Welcome, I'm constant disappointment. Uh, okay, I've got a few uh, videos that I'm planning to make. Uh, uh, this one I've already done. Uh, these ones, I'm just doing a bit more research on one of them. I need to watch like two entire videos. Can you imagine? People don't know how good they got it. But this one is about Tony Morris, who's a, mem a governing body member of the Jehovah's Witnesses organization and if you know the J-dubs, the Jovos, the Jehovah's Witnesses, they they say it's okay to drink booze but it's not okay to get drunk um, and this bloke Tony who bought several bottles of single malt whiskey which I I mean, you can get drunk on that. You don't necessarily have to get drunk on that, but even if it's for sharing with other people, that's... Hello, Kathy. Oh. Um, even if you're sharing with other people, that's... If you're not getting drunk on it, it's going to last you a long time, probably about two years or something. So, um, at, at least he wasn't buying cigarettes, though, because they don't like them at all. Which is one of the things I've got in common with them, to be honest. I smoke cigarettes for a long time, smoke spliffs. That's why it's difficult for me to give up. I think because uh, I'm so used to smoking the noodle with the tobacco. But single malt, though, I never got that. I think it's like wine tasting. It's just an excuse people give themselves to drink booze. It's I. I think, like, if you gave them, if they were, they were expecting champagne and you gave them champagne flutes filled with this stuff, I doubt they'd notice the difference. You know, you could say it was a special kind of champagne or something. And also, single malt, would anyone care if this had more than one type of apple in it? Would anyone even notice? No. It's bullshit. It is, it's poncy nonsense. Goodbye, we're Poland and constant disappointment.